This is Signature Gold. Stop TV. Stand by for transmission. This is Smithy.tv. I've eaten lots of food, I've had lots to drink, and then I went and took a piss. Then I turned on this podcast that is called Cast This! So we've inter- interrupted a, the love conversation between Ryan and uh, Claire to start the show. So well, let's start the show. Okay, this is called Cast This. Cast This, I'm Ryan Goldherr. I'm James Scott, and our guest today is actor, comedian... Claire Brasso. Oh. oh, it's so nice to have you on our show. Thanks. It's, it's nice to have nice a woman here. here. It's nice to have a show. I am yeah. a woman. <laughs> It's nice to be a woman. Yes. I, I love being a woman. Yeah, it's, you guys are gorgeous women. Thank you. We're special kinds of women. I, I like we your are. breasts. It uh, They match our beards. Yeah. It's great. Ryan has a lot larger breasts. I do have larger breasts. Fish tits but, are always a big turn on. Yeah. 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 Uh, oh, they're nice. I've, um, I, uh, I started it out classy, so you're welcome. No, no, no. I, I'm, I'm totally <laughs> open to this. Uh, well, I, 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 I've I just been, I've been using my own. I've been braiding your breasts for about um, three years now. That is sexual. Yeah. Look at how inner city we are. We're so we'll, urban. We'll talk about why <laughs> you're being all sexual uh, later. Yeah. Uh, Claire, you are an actor and a comedian, it says here. Yep. That's what it um, says. That's uh, what it says. <laughs> <laughs> Whether or not it's true. Uh, what came first, the chicken, the egg, the actor, or the comedian? Well, I think uh, the egg, I don't know about the chicken and the egg. Okay. Um, let me workshop that joke. Science has proven yeah. it's the chicken. It has to be. How was it born? God. Yeah, God. <laughs> Have you ever heard of a little guy named God? Um, I was an actor first. I started, I've been acting all my life. Oh, yeah? And then uh, I had a good run in my 20s. I had a good run. And then in my late 20s, I stopped working as much. And uh, I started doing comedy. Well, well what, what, start with that. Uh, what got you into acting? Like, what was the um, start? What was, like... What was your influence? I was always a brat when I was little, and I loved getting attention, and my parents just encouraged it, that jackassery. And uh, and then, you know, that's all I wanted to do. And then when I was in high school, I was in a high school that was, like, catered towards drama, and st- if you wanted. And uh, Here in Toronto or in Montreal? In Montreal, yeah. and I didn't have to take math or science or anything, which is wow cool, but I was also 15 years old making decisions like that I would never need math or science. Well, my sister had a teacher like that, too, said so yeah. the girls didn't need math or science. Yeah, <laughs> so it was crazy. So then I went to college, and I majored in theater and musical theater. What college did you go to? John Abbott College. Where's that? In the West Island of Montreal. Splendid. Yeah. Is that like a CJEP or is that? Yeah, it's yeah. a CJEP, yeah. yeah. And then I moved to New York City. Awesome. Yeah, and I went to the Neighborhood Playhouse. Ooh. Yeah. Long Serious. lineage of great talent. Absolutely, yeah. 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 So, uh, and then I stayed there and acted for a couple of years and sang in a cabaret bar as a part-time job and waitressed. And then I moved to uh, Toronto and Montreal. I went back and forth. Now I'm just here. But it's nice. Like you had, you had parents encouraging you that whole time. Always. That's awesome. Yeah. And well, because I mean, a lot of times you can make a choice like that as an actor, and it's like, I'm going to be an actor. I'm 12 years old, and this is the way I want to be. And it's like that's great for now. It's great if you're a teenager. It's like yeah, let's get it out of your, you know, get it out of the way now, and then get a real job later. And but now look what happens. I'm a 34 year old shit stain. So thanks a lot, mom and dad. Awesome. Oh my goodness. <laughs> the least they can do is offer you some toilet paper. Seriously. Come uh, on. Bacon strips. Uh, uh, do you have actors in the family? Do you have art artistic folks? My grandmother family? was an actress. Mm-hmm. Uh, she lived in New York City. She was like born in Italy, lived in New York most of her life. Do you life. have double citizenship? No, okay. I wish. Um, and she went on to become a very successful housewife. So that's about the extent. One of the best, I hear. Yeah. Like, textbook was, housewife. Oh my goodness, amazing. Yeah. You know, baking pies, giving BJs, the best kind of housewife there is. Well, <laughs> gotta get myself one of those. <laughs> I gotta clean it up. I've offered. Yeah, I but gotta clean this up. I braided your breasts. I'm yeah, sorry. that's true. You did braid my breasts, and I, and I just sort of needed your bum. Yeah. yeah. Um, Buy a dime. What? Ew. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so, uh, what, what sort of um, projects were you acting in during that nice run that you talked about? Um, it's funny that you had the run and then you became a stain. Oh, writer. I know, I know. Well, I mean, it's funny because I guess that's how it was. I was also really skinny when I was like 24, so that got me a lot of work, I guess. But, uh, what? But then we got, no. Um, 
I was doing like nothing major, but I, I was able to work on some films that were super fun. Um, you know, the first movie that I got to work on was Confessions of a Dangerous oh, Mind. Oh, great. Yeah, and I, although I had nothing to do on the film, I had like five days and, you know, I got to work with George Clooney and yeah. and that was fun. And, um, you know, I just got, I got really lucky. I did this one movie when I was 24 and the producers and the director really liked me and they've cast me in three films since then. Fantastic. And I've just had the opportunity to, I was doing it like some TV shows and, you know. This was when Montreal was really bustling as That's an English right. language uh, Yeah. Film city. Mm -hmm. Yes, we, we've experienced the fact that it is not really there anymore. No, it's English not, uh, no. I guess, yeah, you it's, guys would know. We, uh, we see what comes in and goes, and, uh, and yeah, they've slowed down a little. It's mostly French language, and the only English-speaking stuff that goes on there is all like, local only. Well, right now, I mean, I, I just put myself on tape for that. There's a big Julia Roberts film shooting there this summer, right. so... Do you put yourself on tape for the Incendo um, yeah, in pot boiling I've, movies of the week? I've worked for them quite a bit. Have you? I've done three of those. Yeah. Nice. And they're fun. The Ladies in Peril movies. Oh my goodness. I, uh, <laughs> I got to say, I can't believe you've been framed for murder again in one of them. That's <laughs> so, like a great line. Yeah. That's, yeah. Uh, that's what I would put on my tombstone. Yeah. <laughs> Framed for murder again. Oh, ah. Come on! <laughs> uh, but those are super fun to do. Uh, like, they must be. If you know what you're, if you can just let yourself be okay with the fact that it's like horrific, you know, scripts. Uh, these are like straight to W Network kind of shows? Yeah, but they play them all the time. Do they? Oh my god, I get Who was the nominal, uh, kind of slightly past their prime American star, star of, of the ones that, that you were in? I did one with Who Elisa were? Donovan, who's, who's lovely. She was in Clueless. She's Princess Amber, okay. the redhead. Mm -hmm. She was amazing, and I played her best friend in the film, so we had tons of scenes together, and we just got along like a house on fire, so we're still friends. And then in another one, it was Janine Garofalo. So it's really oh, lucky. That must have been excellent. Super she's fun. She's no longer past. She's now a star again. Like she's got a new series. Yeah. That's right, yeah. Yeah, Criminal Minds. Yeah. And then the... Spin-off. Yeah. And then she... <laughs> and then the other one was uh, Cynthia Preston, uh, who... Um, the name rings a bell. She was in a film Kelly called... Preston. In she, she was in Whale Music, which okay. was a Canadian film. So is she Canadian? She's but she lives in LA now, and she's been like on CSI Miami. And oh, okay. So she does a lot of like uh, one-off guest shows yeah. on all the different shows, yeah, and then like guest stars. comes back to Canada as a star. Exactly. Right. And she was really fun, although I only had a few days on that one, so I didn't really get to know her that Who long. did you get to say, I can't believe you've been... Elisa. Nice. It was hilarious. It was really hard to do those lines with a straight face. Like really, and it was always like someone's been murdered, how they know and it's that like, you're a professional oh. if you can pull it off. Yeah, we really had some good laughs when we shot that one. It was uh, called uh, "Framed for Murder." So. Oh, <laughs> well, how can well, you put the title in the one? Yeah. Well, it's 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 what makes it official. That it's, it's well, I was watching just last night. I was uh, having some trouble sleeping, so I put on a really boring movie called "Farewell Friend," starring uh, Charles Bronson and Alain Delon. Oh, and. Uh, there's this one part where they're parting ways and Charles Bronson turns to Alain Delon and goes, Farewell, friend. <laughs> nice. I go, ah, that's how you got the yeah. name of that. Nice. Okay. I guess the line, we got to get the hell out of here, <laughs> wasn't quite <laughs> yeah, exactly. use that one. Not quite uh, we're going to take our first commercial break. Uh, and we'll be back and right we'll, after this. Right back. Yes, back. Hey, welcome we, back with to Claire Brasso. Hi. Cast this. Cast this with Claire Brasso. Claire. Uh, well, we've covered the acting. acting. What about we've the comedy? We've also spoken in unison. Let's say to you right now. Okay, oh, how so did you get into comedy and stand up in particular? Um, I I've always done sketch comedy. Like I worked with Second City when I like fifteen years ago, and I, I you know I was always into that and improv. And then I started doing improv in Montreal with. Um, the guys that did that film, Fubar, mm -hmm. uh, like Dave and Paul and those guys, and the Kidnapper film guys, and so we used to do that. And then, when I was 27, I did stand up once or twice, and then I stopped for like a year. And then I decided when I was 28 to throw myself into it kind of full force, and I just started telling jokes. I didn't tell anybody for like six months. You were just doing it, going to like the small clubs, and open mics, and yeah, and then. Uh, yeah, and then every in comedy it happened really fast because I started uh, in Montreal and I was at the time the only young straight female comic. 
So I got a lot of stage time and a lot of opportunity that I probably wouldn't have had so quickly it's, otherwise. It's, it's otherwise. easy to get that time when you're not telling dyke jokes. Yeah, exactly. And I mean, you know, there's a couple of, of gay women in Montreal who are hilarious. And the, I mean, most of them are gone now and they've moved. But it was just like I was the only one that had that to offer. So I, I just I had a lot of sta stage time. I got to do that quickly and then I moved to Toronto. And your in your segments and your bits, you look I guess you start with a two, three minute uh, bit and then you get, you know, more and more time as time progresses or yep. were you thrown into like, hey, you get ten minutes, go. No, well you do five minutes your first time up and, yeah. and uh, most open mics you get five to seven minutes unless it's like a better open mic. Sometimes you get ten. That's pretty rare. But then um, I got just for laughs very soon into my career well, that's as a good. comic. Yeah. yeah, I wasn't ready, but I wasn't gonna say no. And at the time, you know, you don't know. Like, you think that you know everything. I've only been doing it for six years now, but still, like, I well, realized six years. I think I, I think would probably feel like a long time when you're <laughs> going on the road and you're doing shows in different cities. Now, I mean, you tour cities. Yeah, that's all I do now. Yeah, so I mean, how did you get on that circuit? I worked for so when I got the homegrown competition for Just for Laughs, uh, I met with Mark Breslin, who owns Yuck Yucks, and we had a really nice meeting and we got along right away. And he has been extremely supportive. He's been a huge champion of mine, and he's worked me and he's pushed for me, and he's just been fantastic. So I started working like pretty soon into my career, like getting right. paid. And six years, you're right. I mean, I've just started headlining this year, yeah. which is great. Um, and you know, I got to do some amazing festivals and some great things have been happening, but it's still only six years. Like I realize I have a lot of learning left to do, but at least I kind of get it now. Yeah. You're not, you're not a newbie anymore. No, not really. No. Yeah. So where, where, so this year, what, uh, this, I mean, this, has this year been uh, a significantly better year than most or? Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. This year has been amazing. Like. I did the Sudbury Comedy Festival, which was so much fun. I mean, I know I realize it's Sudbury, but they just they had a great well, lineup. Who was Sudbury? They got they got they got stuff off. Well, it. it's like those people live on the moon. Yeah. Yeah. Because of all the slag that comes out. Yeah. So they're kind of isolated, and they like their arts. They get a lot of theater through there. And yeah, they bands were bands and. They had a great comedy. lineup, yeah. and they treated us well. And then. Uh, is and that then, where Science North is, or no? Is it Science North? I know it's where the big nickel is. It is. That's right. Yeah, yeah which I didn't see. But I also what? just did Winnipeg Comedy Festival, and I did my first TV gala. So that was really fun. Oh, that's great. Sweet. Yeah, that was amazing. And headlining that? No, well, the gala is like, oh, it's, is it? it's a, it's, you know when you watch on TV, like the Just for Laughs or Winnipeg right. Comedy Festival, and they just, so they give you 12 minutes. You shoot your thing. There's and then like they a famous take clips of it and mix yeah, they'll it up. Use, they'll exactly. use three or four minutes of exactly. it or something. Yeah, that's exactly it. Awesome. So. What uh, what cities have been the most responsive uh, to you in your uh, tours your across place? across it's Canada? Funny. I I love Toronto. Mm -hmm. Toronto's always. I mean, downtown Toronto. Vaughan, I don't love. Oakville, don't love it. Although it can be fun. Yeah. You know, Ajax can be fun. Um, I love playing Halifax. I love playing St. John's, Newfoundland. I love playing Calgary. I don't love Edmonton. Um, but you know, the small towns are great. Like I know it's like lame, small town, but it's like, I've always lived in big cities, right? So it's like, those people know how to party. They're awesome. They're just so like, they want to laugh. They don't have a ton of stuff to do at night, yeah. live entertainment. So they really support it, you know, and they, they're great. And uh, conversely, what is the most difficult uh, town you've played? I've never had a good set in Vaughn. <laughs> no. Really? And you know what? Vaughn, generally, they don't like female comics. Is that right? Yeah, like, there are no female comics that I can think of that kill it in Vaughn. I've got a question for you. Where is Vaughn? Exactly. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's, it's anything north of Steel's practical. Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah? So Woodbridge and... It's Woodbridge. Oh, okay. Exactly. That area. Yeah, I can see that. It's like, it's like just up on the 400, like, <laughs> just past Toronto. Okay. Okay. <laughs> But it's it's like worse than Barry, <laughs> which is a yeah, tough. Days, that's, that's, that's a that's a <laughs> these days Barry's making its mark. Come on. Yeah, seriously. Get What's it, it doing, Ryan? What's Barry doing? They've got great hospitals at schools. Why are you Place? living in Barry? God no. no. He's, <laughs> I, he's sponsored by the Barry Chamber of Commerce. <laughs> yeah, seriously. Yeah. yeah. My uh, my niece, the BBB the does Barry Better Business and, uh, Bureau, and she uh, and she competes out of Barry. Ooh. That's why you love Barry it's, so much. Well. Barry is. 
the old club in Barrie was not awesome. The new club, I kind of like it a lot better, but Barrie is... I, I, I mean, I'm in <laughs> Hamilton tonight. For the most part, it was usually a passing point from... Like, How's Hamilton? Park. Hamilton is fine. <laughs> Nothing to write home about. It's no Vaughn. It's no Vaughn. It's no Vaughn. I mean, I've had good sets in Hamilton. Mm -hmm. Now, is it Hamilton proper? You're like up on the hill in Dundas? or It's like not in a great area. It's, yeah. it's right beside the Hooters. That's the best. I know. I mean... That's where you're going to get the drunks who are going to come in and just laugh. Yeah, and heckle and look like they're the sons of anarchy. <laughs> but, uh, no, it's okay. It'll be fine. It's, uh, it's my cousin. Oh, <clears throat> I lo I'm obsessed with sons of I, anarchy. I, I love Hamilton. Uh, oh, do you? I've got a question for you. Back to uh, your it. set. Yeah. How aren't they great? No, I'm just yeah. Kidding. Oh yeah, we're I gonna get to that after the break. But I first, to my but first, the gesture, breasture. Yes. Yeah. Breast Breasturing. Breasturing. Yeah. Um, uh, your your material. Yeah. How often do you uh, take bits out and put new stuff in, and how how do you change it up? Um. That's a good what question. What makes you decide to change it up? Well, I smoke a lot of pot. Okay. Um, and I. Why do all comedians smoke a lot of pot? Because it's so fun. And, okay. it's, and it's there. And it, well, yeah. I mean, I pay for it. I'm, well, I'm sure. Yeah. But, but I so the what dealer is, knows where to go. Yeah, exactly. Um, so I uh, I I'll usually just s a j before I go to sleep at night, yeah. Yeah. and then I'll keep a pad beside my bed and I write jokes mostly when I'm high, not always. Mostly. And then uh, if I think it's funny, then I'll try it out. But I would never try it out like on, I'm not as ballsy to like try it on, on a paid weekend spot. Yeah. I might, I'll try it out at an open mic or a guest spot. Um, unless it's like one line and I'm doing like 35 minutes, then I'll throw it in there mm -hmm. somewhere. But I, I don't generally. And, and how much of s stuff that was in your set, say last year around this time, is in your set now? A hundred percent. <laughs> You've only had one since so you, you were You haven't 20. done some, uh, some returns six years to any new locations. I like haven't this. written it. No, I'm kidding. Um, I mean, you know, you start off with five minutes, and then now I have probably about an hour that I feel good about. Maybe 45 minutes that I feel really good about. Mm -hmm. Now, so. depending on the set, you pick and choose the material exactly. to just put it together. So it's never, never necessarily the exact same set every time, but it's like I usually it's the same the material same and just like re... Yeah shuffled exactly and it's like if I'm doing like a fundraiser for like an elderly retirement home I'm not gonna go in and do like the mercy killing jokes that you jokes. Do? Yeah. yeah mercy killing is but yeah Kevorkian goes a long way there I yeah think. exactly they love they love that stuff mm -hmm. so should we take another break let's take another break and okay we'll be, uh, we'll be right back with, with Claire Brasso on cast this I have pressed the button, button, and we are back on Cast This. Cast This. Yay. We're with, we're with Claire, Claire Brasso. Yay. Now, Claire, you've been doing uh, a, kind of, I guess, a piece of conceptual art for the last year. Sure, let's uh, go. I wanted to, I've been thinking of what to call it, okay. and I think that's what I'm going to call it. I a like piece that. of conceptual art, or uh, not conceptual because you haven't been having sex. Yeah. Uh, it's called The Man Baddicle. Tell yeah. us a little bit about this so, and why you decided to do it. Uh, so last year on May 18th, 2010, I decided to stop dating dudes completely, stop flirting, stop dating, no sex, no kissing, no nothing, um, for a complete year and blog about it. And, uh, and so I've got five days left and it has been a real trip. And, uh, I started cause I was dating douches all the time. I can't stop dating douches. How's your following? Like, I mean, blogging about it is one thing, but getting the word out. I mean, honestly, uh, uh, not honest. Uh, uh, obviously, you probably have, uh, you know, a connection if you're tweeting about it, what's going on every day. Or are you tweeting daily? Um, I tweet every day. I post about every two to three days. Right. But I've been really lucky because I got a lot of press, and I've been doing a lot of press throughout the year. So it's like... You know, it's in Now Magazine. Um, like, I was able to do breakfast television and the Marilyn Dennis show and Q and Suki and Lee's show on CBC. And, um, you know, like, they've just been really good at giving me press, and that just really helps with the numbers. So I've been very lucky that way. 
uh, excellent. Yeah. So I, and so those those shows have uh, were they and they were able to now were they specifically aimed at the man Batical or were they uh, about you as a comedian and then on top you were able to promote it's them? about the man Batical. It was yeah, cool. all about the man Batical. Did yeah. you uh, did you hire a publicist to, to no, get to that? No, but you know how what? How, how'd you get on all these shows? I am really good at that stuff. Yeah. I am really good and it's like a full time job being your own PR person. Yeah, it's crazy. So, uh, say you wanted to get on the Suki and Lee show. How? Right. What did you? Did you know her already? Did you send her an email? Did you? How did you get in you touch with what? her? You know what? We have Suki and I have a lot of mutual friends. Mm -hmm. But I didn't. I'd never met her, which was weird. But she, her producer, contacted me. Like oh, Q great. contacted me. I had done Q before as a comic, but yeah. Q contacted me. Jian's a good friend of mine, but they contacted me. Um, Breakfast Television. I. I did that. Marilyn Dennis, I did that myself. Um, now Magazine, I uh, Michael Hollett, who owns Now Magazine, is a very dear friend, and he's been very supportive. And uh, just, just like, you know, I just, I guess so many years of being in the business, you make friends in the business, yeah. and they help you out, and that's what happened. That's great. I, I've done a ton of radio shows, so. So a year. A year. What? How do you feel? And are you going to have sex in five days? I might. And I say that only because I am an alcoholic. Yeah. And so I want to say no, but I also know that if I have too many cocktails, I could just bang some random dude. Um, but I don't think I'm going to. Like, I haven't met anybody that I want to... Like, no, has this been a real, like, lesson for you as well? And like, so you haven't had to turn away non-douches during the year? Oh, yes, I have. Oh, have you? And yeah. I fell in love for three months. I was in love with somebody. Which was were, very difficult. Were they reciprocating? Yeah. That sucks. For a while he was. But he lives in Los Angeles. He doesn't come up here. I'm on a minbatical. He's got a lot of He's got a problems. wife and three children. Well, he does have three children and two ex-wives. And there was a lot of stuff. So that didn't work out. And it kind of devastated me. But, I mean, we didn't have sex. So that was weird. But it's important to actually yeah. get through that. So. Well, so you haven't had like some secret sex that you're not telling no. anyone about, just c to you know, just to stay pure and. I know that people. Project? I know that I've, I'm allowed to masturbate. I'm allowed to jill yeah. off, which is you know, I'm not trying to punish myself. Jill off. Yeah. I've never I, heard I, that. I That's like, pretty I like good. That term. Really? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah. So uh, <coughs> let's like Jack Jill. Yeah. Uh, Yo, okay. I got, got it. it. Yeah. yeah. Um, <laughs> <laughs> it makes sense. We like it. Yeah. I have had We're a few slip ups. Yeah, yeah. Got dudes are always I'm pro jacking too. Yeah, I mean, me too. Who yes. is it? Crying out loud. You know what I mean? This, oh, we're this, used to it. This whole yeah. thing's gonna turn into a massive circle jerk after. So yeah, I hope. So. Well, I, I mean, I, I hope we run out of. <laughs> <laughs> I hope we run out of things to say so that we can just do it to I'm, fill up the. I'm doing it right now. Party. You guys can't tell, but that's what I'm. Anyway. I thought um, you could notice the thumping sound. Yeah, in the background. exactly. Yeah. It's disgusting. Yeah, um, know, grow up. <laughs> <laughs> And, and now I feel shame. <laughs> don't. No, I don't feel shame. I think this is great. No, you sit in the box and you feel shame. It's my favorite quote. From and then I go free. Yeah, it's my favorite quote. Fuck, I love that movie. Two minutes, you uh, feel shame. Then you sit in the box and you feel shame. Um, it's from Slapshot. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Yep. Uh, what were we talking? Oh, yeah. So I, ha I have not had sex. I have had a slip up. A few slip ups where I've like made out with dudes and I've always come clean about it in my blog the next day. Mm -hmm. And I have, you know, definitely. Have there been her. 10 plus slip ups or like two or three? Well, when I was okay. in love with that guy, there was a couple. There was a couple. And then I went to Halifax and I met this guy, and that was a bit of a slip up. I didn't sleep with him, and God love him, he tried. Have you touched privates other than your own over the year? Yeah. Yeah. That's pretty close. I know. That's it's really, totally breaking that's, that's, the rule. But, I mean, for the most part, well, I mean. It was just three months. How active were you before this year? I'm not, like, a huge whore or anything. And, in fact, I haven't had that many partners considering I've been sexually active for 20 years. Hmm. Like. So only about 77 partners or so? No, not even. Really? I know. 60. Less. 16. More. <laughs> like, way more. <laughs> <laughs> the last 10 minutes is 36, no, no. 48. <laughs> Almost. Nope. Colder, colder, warmer, warmer. But, uh... That's how we fill up the end of it. <laughs> yeah, exactly. 
Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly
honking. Anyway, right. We Vibe was kind enough to send me a vibrator, um, which I used. Are, are they sponsoring the Mathematical? <laughs> no, but they did send me free stuff, so That's that nice. was really nice. Yeah. Um, and there's just been. Is just that We Vibe as in Nintendo We Vibe? Uh, no, <laughs> it's not for kids. Oh. No. <laughs> It's this vibrator. It's been like on Oprah and everything. Really? Yeah, it's really cool. It's like this U-shaped thing. It's made for couples. Like you can use it alone. U-shaped. Oh, so it's like it's in you and it, maybe it, it tickles his bum. No, it you? doesn't tickle his bum. You clip it onto like your his balls your and just sort of vibrates and inside of you, and then the dude puts his dink in. In it. In you, and then it's like. Oh, I see. I see. I see. Yeah. I see. So it's like it's. Oh my god, look! We're all doing it right now! Disgusting! It's Ew. not disgusting, it's no, actually it quite simple. It's disgusting. I'm gonna vomit. <laughs> Alright. Um. <laughs> so. Get it together. Yeah. Jesus Christ. We spent a lot of time together. I know. Um, a guy accused me of being a Zionist on the weekend, and I'm not Jewish. But do you believe in the preservation of Israel? Sure. Why not? Sure. Sure. I'm not going to say that I don't in front of you. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> 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 oh, Who said I was a Zionist? Oh, my God. I'm a self-hating Jew. What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so you jerk off. Jack, Jill off. Yeah, go on. Um, the end. We're done. Yeah. <laughs> That's usually the That's end. it. Well, we're really happy to have you here. Thanks. It was so fun. <laughs> it was nice really great. Thanks for it. Yeah. Thanks. Uh, awesome. I want you, though, to come back after the five days or sometime and, yep. and just tell us mm -hmm. about when the, 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 the veritable orgy that's going to occur. Can I plug my, my site? Absolutely. Yes, please do. Plug okay. away. So if you want to read the blog, which you should because it's very sexy and funny and genuine and sad and, and all of that stuff. It's at clairebrasso.com, which is C L A I R E B R O S S E A U dot com. C O M. Yeah, C O M. Not C U M. No, no, it's dot com. Not C A L M. Dot com. <laughs> yeah. C -A -L so relaxed. Oh. Yes, it's. Uh, You'll it's be relaxed after you read my blog. Fantastic. Yeah. So. And you're playing in Hamilton tonight. Yeah. I'll quick break. What or do you have anything lined up throughout the summer that you can talk about? Because I don't know when this is going to yeah, be we, up on. Yeah, the totally. If you go to my website, my all my tour dates are there. My demo reel for acting is there. Some stand ups on there. You hear me singing on there. It's everything at that website. Nice. Like, What's nice. your website? Deluxe. ClaireBrasso.com. She just finished spelling yeah. it out then. <laughs> Say it again. Thank you. ClaireBrasso.com. ClaireBrasso.com. Yeah. Not C A L M. No. So what is it? ClaireBrasso.com. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I like that one. Oh, that's, that's pretty good. good. You can one. use that. Thank you. Not to be confused with Jay Brasso. No. Or Ruth Ellen Brasso. Mm, the what's, chick from Vegas. What's, it, what's that again? ClaireBrasso.com. Dot com. Dot com. Nice. Or Jean Jacques Rousseau. No. The French uh, philosopher from the, no. from the no, Age no. of Enlightenment. Don't, don't. I don't think he has a website. He does. It's, no, I'm kidding. I don't know. <laughs> so here's a recording from his website. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so this has been Cast This. We'll see you all next time. I'm James Scott. I'm Ryan Goldhart. Thank you, Claire. Thank you. Bye.